What does it take to get a job in 2025? Everything. You have to pull out every single playbook. Like you have to open your playbook and pull out every single thing. Right? First, you have to have the skill. Right? It's a saturated market in that there are a lot of people who are looking for jobs and employers have their pick, right? Because of all these layoffs. And so you're not just competing with people who are either breaking in new, right? You're competing with people who may have some experience in big tech as well, but they either got laid off or yeah, they mostly got laid off. So that's now your competition. Right? So whatever skill that you think is needed for that role, whatever skill that is listed in that space, it's something that you need to have experience in to even be competitive in the role. That's the first part, right? Second part is the job application, right? And networking. A company posts a job, there are hundreds, if not thousands of applications almost immediately. How do you stand out? That's the question. That should be what, what you ask yourself. If your resume is good, it'll be kind of like sieved across to one side with again, hundreds of, of resumes. How do you then pop out of that whole stack, right? That's where you start to go the extra mile, right? Try to use your contacts, figure out who the hiring manager is, figure out who the recruiter is, send them a message. 9.5 out of 10 times, they won't respond, but it's a numbers game. You want to be the kind of person who gets in this position, you have to do what people aren't willing to do.